guys, Airman May here back with another video. Today's video is going to be a tour of Navy Air Station in Pensacola, Florida. You guys are probably wondering what's here. I'm going to give you a good idea what's around this base and some cool stuff you can do here. Let us begin. All right, so right now we are actually at the front of the quarter deck where most of the airmen line up and accountability. This is usually the front entrance when we leave out of the building. Right now we're at the galley. This is where all the airmen, sailors, and marines pretty much have their meal. If you make a right from where we were, you basically just keep walking down the sidewalk and you will make it to the building. Now typically, we don't call it the galley. We call it the defect, back at training. But here they call it the galley. We usually enter right over there and there's two different sides. Usually if you want a really quick meal, hamburgers, fries, whatever, you go over to the right side, that's the fast lane. And if you want something that's actual entree, you go over to the left side. Now, if you notice behind me, this is where most of the servicemen actually have their dorm. They live all in these housing over here. And we came from all the way over that way. And that's usually the airman barracks, if you can see them walking all the way over there. There's the airmen walking from where we started, right by the galley, right over that way. Now it's pretty interesting because we have a lot of different servicemen here. Basically everybody does like a chant heading to class. We have this thing called US Cadence that a lot of airmen do on our way to class. And we do it marching all the way to class every morning and marching all the way back to our dorms. You have breaks. It depends, halfway through the day, you usually have like an hour lunch break to do whatever you want, just can't leave the base. Okay, leaving on a class, we usually come from here, walk our way this way, and march over that way. Straight ahead, we got the next, or our Walmart. <laughs> Right next to it is three different parts of the next. We got the main part where we usually get our food. Then we have like different restaurant inside that next over there, along with a clothing part of the next, which is also over there as well. So this is inside of the next, guys. Dude, I almost wanted to buy this. We have a movie theater connected to our fitness center. They actually have a list of movies and the times. So you can see it's up to date movies. He's nice. No, he's not. Behind the scenes, no. I'm mm. go. go back out to the theater. Now what's nice about this is that they have pull-up bars right outside the gym and the movie theater. So if you're looking for a workout, by all means, come here. If you're looking to play basketball, they have a basketball court too. So going forward, that is port side and that is the basketball court. Now this is what port side pretty much has inside the building. Pretty good stuff. This is the inside of port side. Got the bar over here, and across from it we have, what do you call this? Theater room. Theater room. We're gonna check that out. Cause we gotta go in there to get bikes. Got a little games and stuff out. Massage chairs. Even have an arcade room. Top of the theater room. Back of port side, you can head outside to the little patio. And the restaurants is there. Come outside and yeah, play a little game and stuff over in that area over there. Intermission had to get me some Taco Bell. I'm not. I might not put this in here, but oh yeah, don't look at me. I'm fat. <laughs> We have a bunch of games you can also look at in the game room. And that is the game room over there. Basically show them your ID and you are all set to go. Also got computers and movies you can watch up there on the second floor as well.
So that was pretty much port side, guys. Right now, I'm about to get my bike and check out the base that way. Wait, wait, wait. There we go. What's nice here is that right behind pork side, it's really windy, so I'm gonna do a yacht, a lot of belly. We have a trail here leading back where people do a lot of fishing. A lot of people wondering if you can fish. You get here, you can, but you gotta be in your ABUs for a short amount of time during your first phasing, which is your BTP phasing. Until you get to ITP, that's when you can get out of uniform and just dress in your regular civilian clothes to fish, along with other activities too. We're gonna move on now. Trying to get to the lighthouse. I believe this path going all the way down takes us all the way to the lighthouse right over there. In the back, we got the beach right over here. Nice little trail here. And it's going all the way back from the base. So this bad boy here is one of the Blue Angels F-18 Hornet. Now it's fun because when you're in class, they actually fly over and train while you're in class because they all over the place. Real loud and fast, but that is the Blue Angels, guys. So I found a trail going towards the lighthouse, Radford Boulevard Trail in Pensacola. It's a nice walk if you're looking for a walk. A little park here. Soon if you got children, you can bring them to the park. Real quick, guys. Tell me, what is this monument here? It looks like a monument. Do you have any idea what that could be back there? Comment down below. I'm curious. If it helps, there's a flag up there and also a little cannon up there. Halfway to the lighthouse, Navy Lounge, Lighthouse Point, CPO Club. And back where we pass is Barranca blah, 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 Beach. <laughs> Barrancas Beach. Barrancas. This is a museum. I don't know how we stumbled across it though. Aircraft. This is something you can do on your free time. If you have nothing to do, by all means, walk the trail, take a bike to the trail, come to the museum. <laughs> it's like a good commercial. And come to the museum of naval aviation. After climbing through jungles, we have finally found the lighthouse. Ah! All the way up. After 177 steps. Here we've made it guys, finally to the top of the lighthouse. So some of you guys might not know, they have this thing called a USO, which is basically people help out the military, volunteer, give free food or free stuff away to a military service member. So here we are inside the USO guys. One of the rooms they have here is a pool room. They have a kitchen here that you could basically use anything in. A game room. Right. So usually have movies playing. Interesting things here. They always host different types of events. So like that's the schedule they have for this month. Another game room they have here. Now, if you like to play music and you're a magician, musician, you're gonna like this room. They have a lot of different instruments in this room. Guitars. And the small ukulele. There you guys have it. That is my tour of the base. If you guys like the video, give a thumbs up. Comment, comment down below in the box. And be sure to check out the other videos I post every week. Only thing I missed in this video was the restaurants inside the next. We had like a Subway and a Chinese restaurant. That is some of the things that you guys can pretty much check out while on base. Also have a lot of other events and stuff and places you can check out outside of the base as well. All right guys, I will see you later. Let's get